How are you feeling? Uh, feeling good, feeling good. Uh, been doing a lot of running recently and very competitive running. Well, old dual meet, uh, basically prelims, finals, and then this weekend, obviously Mount Sac. So uh, I've been working a lot to restore my body. I've been kind of a, feeling a little tired, you know, muscles are heavy, everything. So Monday I had a good uh, cruise, and then today I pushed it, but I made sure to take it easy and keep in mind that I still have races this weekend and three more throughout the day today. So uh, definitely tried hard to qualify and win, but definitely more in the tank as well. And you're talking about how you know your, your, your season is structured. You go up, you take a break a little bit, then you launch yeah. at the end. Where are we at in that? Uh, so last week we had Loyola, probably uh, one of our most hype meets of the year. Our program values winning a lot, winning a, our league title and such, given that the boys, we won our first title last year, this is the second year. So valued that a lot and then going to that race, I was just pretty amped up and that I think what got me to the 46-6. So I would say that was a high point, definitely. And then right now, uh, just making sure to keep my body healthy and uh, so I can you know, shoot back up, hopefully drop below 46 come the state time. How are you feeling about your health, your health and your physical state? You feeling good? Yeah, yeah, I'm feeling good. Just I've had a, a whole year this year, this school year, I've been dealing with uh, problems with my sinuses and stuff like that. So I've had complications with feeling sick, not really sick, but just all those kinds of symptoms definitely have me feeling uh, under the weather, I would say. But as long as I keep that healthy and keep my body uh, covered. Okay. And again, the rest of postseason, you know, finals coming up very, very quick. What event are you focusing on the most? At the moment, I don't have an answer to that question. Uh, a lot of things opened up. I've always thought about doing both 300 and the 400 individually. But now, after running 46, and having trouble with my hurdles. You know, the 400 sounded like a lot more appealing than it was before. But uh, I still have a lot for the three hurdles and I still wanna, I can't believe I haven't broken 37 yet because my ultimate goal is to break 36. So we'll see. We'll see as the next uh, couple of meets come up, see what I wanna do more. Has your training changed the last couple weeks? Has it changed at all? Um, yeah, it's changed because of all the meets that we've been running. We've been running back-to-back -back meets high comp competition needs as well. So definitely been, uh, once again, trying to heal up the body, but still getting in solid work. Every Monday, our hybrid workouts are no joke. No joke. Yeah.